In this lecture, we will discuss about nitration of benzene. If benzene is treated with hot concentrated nitric acid, it gives nitrobenzene. Generally, this reaction is not used in the laboratory because HNO3 is also a good oxidizing agent. So, hot conch HNO3 is a strong oxidizing agent. So, it can basically oxidize any material that is in the laboratory and it can explode so it can react with any oxidizable material substance and it can explode and explosion explosion can take place So we use an indirect path, we use HNO3 concentrated HNO3 in the presence of H2SO4. This also gives nitrobenzene. Now in this case H2SO4 is basically acting as a catalyst to generate NO2 plus ion. So if you see in this case NO2 plus is the electrophile if you, if you remember on benzene we have electrophilic aromatic substitution so in this case electrophile is NO2 plus so let us discuss mechanism for this reaction. First step that is generation of electrophile So we can generate electrophile from HNO3 so this is HNO3 and we have H2SO4 H2SO4 will act as a acid and it can donate a proton to this oxygen So in this case we will have this oxygen will have a plus charge plus O minus HSO4 minus. Now this becomes a good leaving group so in the next step we can lose one molecule of water so if I lose one molecule of water from this we will have N double bond O at the same time we can shift one lone pair of electron of oxygen to form a bond now nitrogen will have a plus charge and we will have HSO4 minus so we have generated the electrophile so this is the electrophile Now in the second step attack of electrophile to the benzene ring. That is benzene will act as a nucleophile and NO2 plus it will act as electrophile so this attacks here nitrogen cannot form 5 bonds so we have to remove one bond so now I will have here we have a hydrogen so 
So this is attachment of NO2. This carbon will have a plus charge. Now the third step is loss of H plus. That is regain of aromaticity. In this case basically we have a loss of aromaticity initially benzene aromatic now this is not aromatic so this step is loss of aromaticity so in this step benzene ring will regain its aromaticity by losing one molecule of hydrogen 1H plus so if I lose H plus I will have this nitrobenzene. So this is the final product. Nitrobenzene can be easily reduced. So if I have nitrobenzene and if it this is treated with SNHCl, TNHCl, it can be converted into NH2. So nitro group can be converted into NH2. So this is a way to prepare amines. So now we have this is a aromatic amine so nitrobenzene can be used to prepare aromatic amine that is nitrobenzene can be easily reduced so this reaction is reduction So in this case we have one intermediate so if I draw the potential energy diagram for this reaction since we have one intermediate we will have two transition state and the first transition state will be having high energy second transition will state will be having low energy so this is the reactant benzene plus H2SO4 plus HNO3 finally I have product that is nitrobenzene and this is intermediate that is we have NO2 hydrogen hydrogen plus so this is the potential energy diagram on X coordinate we have reaction progress So we have important point in this reaction. In case of nitration, H2SO4, HNO3 is used as a reagent. Second important point we have, NO2 plus in this reaction is acting as catalyst, acting as electrophile. B generally does not use so hot conch HNO3 is generally not used. And the last point we have that is nitro group in benzene can be easily reduced by SNHCl to give aromatic amines.